Okay. We're getting into the uh, engine compartment. This is a this is a Mark One. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, rest of the stuff's over there. Where's the number plate gone? Oh, I can't see it now. But uh, oh, uh, there's a bumper and some extra stuff, all in good nick, actually. Take it off very delicately. Gators and this is the uh, cooler for the uh, motors. That's the. That's the. Uh, yeah. Okay. So anyway, so we've got into it. This at the front here is the uh, AC radiator, which is full size. That's why it had really good AC. <laughs> it's got a big radiator on it. And I might have to leave that in place. The actual cooler, the, the radiator for the engine, uh, is removed. So it's right there and over there. So we're getting into it. The, the air filters come off and other stuff as well. The headlights are obviously taken out. And we're getting into it. Uh, just for interest's sake. Down there. You can see is the crash. That's the uh, there. That's a crash sensor. There's another one there. It's an easy one to see. It detects the uh, impact and deploys the airbags. So we're getting into it. I've got to have to um, take it off by the subframe. I'm going to drop it out, and there's a reason for that. It's because unless I discharge the aircon, which I actually don't want to do. That's the uh, yes. That's the pump. The aircon pump. And the pipe comes over the top of the engine into uh, to feed the aircon system. So it, I can discharge it, obviously, and take the pipe away, but I don't actually want to do that. In fact, the original plan was to drop it down and remove the subframe. So I can actually take the AC pump off and then move it out of the way and then drop the engine down and it should all work. So that's next. Yeah.